on guys so guys i got a quick video guys for you guys i want to see if i can defrost my mirrors because my mirrors are completely frosted and um I, my visibility right now is not so great um and of course you know we got the mirrors the tow mirrors which we uh acquired from uh ebay so i'm pretty sure um as questions that i've received before is how great are they how great are the mirrors especially when it comes to uh you know do they have the functionality of uh defog so that way when your mirror fogs up you can just press your defog button and it will defog the windows so we're about to check that out in a couple of minutes once i get to a parking spot and um see if we can uh test her out it's a absolutely cold day as you guys can see our mirrors they are fogged up so this is going to give us the opportunity to see if these ebay mirrors can actually defog just look at that how it looks when I'm driving so for anyone that's wondering will the eBay towing mirrors can you actually defog let's find out Maybe not the best place to actually <laughs> record this at a bank late at night. <laughs> Let's get ready to get out of the area. But uh, we're going to start her up. And it's been so long since I used the defogger before in a vehicle that I uh, absolutely forgot. Let me kind of zoom in on you guys so you guys can see. It's definitely fogged up. So if I'm not mistaken... This should be our mirror defogger. This should be our rear defogger. Hmm. Because right now I have this setting on for the front, okay? Well, maybe this may be a combination of front and back. Definitely the back window is clear. So let's hit this bad boy here. All right, so that's on. It just did a little something uh, that, like the truck response was a little different. So what I'm going to do is get out this parking lot, guys. So I don't want the cops to come and be like, look, it's, uh, it's 12 o'clock in the morning. You're sitting here outside of a bank. Oh, oh, look at that. Look at that. Up. That was quick. That was real quick. Okay. So top mirrors definitely are warm. And I and I seen a little little thing in between. So uh, there's the boys right there. So uh yeah. This button right here is for your mirror, guys. Again, like I said, it's been a while since I actually had to use it. Um, and today was the day. So now that it's clear, and you can definitely see how clear that is. I'm going to disable it. And now I'm going to go about my day. Go about my night. So that was a really quick, quick, quick video for you guys. Real quick video. So, uh. All right, guys, further than I got down the road, the bottom of the mares are 
super duper clear. So, I don't want to be uh, driving down. Hold on, guys, let me turn. I want to be driving down and let me see if I can turn this light off because I don't want the people to be. All right, now that I have the light off because I don't want to be driving and recording and people were like, what the hell is he doing? <laughs> you know? But uh, yeah, guys, roll this bad boy down. You can see how clear she is, man. She real clear. Real clear, man. I like that. And it's off. Just to show you guys, it's off. It's turned off. And it's clear. So it seems like, you know, once that top gets clear, you can start moving on down the road, then the bottom will clear up too. So to anybody's, uh, you know, question or concern on if you can defrost the tow mirrors that you purchased off of eBay. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. All right, guys, take it easy. The wheels, they are 20 by nine. Tires, 33 by 1250 R20 LT. This does have the three inch lift kit. And with the 12 by, no, excuse me, the 20 by nine wheels you do have that extra lift as you can see you got the extra tire it's not too much to kick up rocks and stuff to beat up your fenders or anything of that nature it's just it's just perfect it's just perfect i did park it underneath the tree so it is definitely dirty, dusty, um, and it is the season for spiders. Uh, spiders, they like to mate. So other than that, uh, these tires, they are, what is it? Uh, red dirt road, mud terrain. Not too much noise, but doable. Definitely doable. I'm pretty much used to tire noise when you're traveling, uh, cause I had some other mud terrain tires when I had my uh, 99 Land Cruiser. But yeah, she's a beauty. Got a little Jeep up in here. Jeep lovers, got the Jeep for you guys. Other than that, um, I'm gonna just pretty much throw on a uh, quick detailer and just let the rest be history. Again, I do have my three inch lift and you can see the uh, spacer right here. Front stock shocks as well as the rear stock shocks. I do have the Bilstein shocks that I'm gonna put in the Bilstein for the rear and I'm planning on eventually doing the Bilstein's for the front. Um, I can kind of tell somewhat, definitely in the back, you can tell uh, that it needs to be aftermarket shocks. The front, doable, but definitely the back. Unless I have, this is a bit different. If I have my trailer on with something on, um, it's fine when it comes to bumps, but without the trailer on, the back is definitely uh, a bit bouncy. And this is the 2017 Toyota Tundra with the 5.7 V8. Absolutely reliable motor. <laughs> 